third one. We got everybody. What are we reading? We're reading Susie Goose and the Christmas Star. It was Christmas Eve. Susie Goose and her friends were gathered around the tree. It was beautiful, but it was missing one thing. It needs a star on top, honked Susie, just like that bright one in the sky. I will get it. Susie dived off the top of the hill. and flew, whoosh, high up into the sky. But it was not quite high enough. Splat! Never mind, honked Susie. I have another plan. She saw a fence. She climbed to the top, stretched up very, very high, and jumped. But it was not quite high enough. She saw a pile of logs. She climbed to the top, stretched up very, very, very high, and jumped. But it was not quite high enough. Splat! Susie decided to walk to the star. The wind was blowing. The snow was falling. It was getting late. Susie walked and walked and walked. She was tired. It is Christmas Eve. I cannot reach the star, and I am very far from home, she thought. Poor Susie. Susie Goose was alone. She was lost. She had Susie Goose. Then she heard sounds in the distance. They were sounds she knew. Ding, honk, ding, honk. <laughs> ding, honk. Susie honked back, then she hurried towards the sounds. Ding, honk. She went past the logs. Ding, honk. Over the fence. Ding, honk. And back up the hill. Yee-haw! Moo, <laughs> moo. Oink, oink. Susie's friends were so happy to see her. And Susie was happy to see her friends. Then she noticed that some of the other geese were staring up at the sky. Susie turned around and saw that the star was shining right above the Christmas tree. It was almost like magic. Merry Christmas, honked Susie Goose. Oh, Susie Gibbs.